It's Sunday today, we're sat on the kitchen floor because nobody else is up except us and we are filming what I eat in a day today because I haven't done one of them for a while. Oh look, Poppy's up too. What are you eating today? So yeah, we're just going to do that and I'm going to eat lots of food and we're going to show you it too. But I am going to keep it vlog style like I've done them before. I don't know if you've seen my what I eat in a day vlogs before but I do them kind of like a vlog but I don't show anything else but food in the vlog because I get a bit carried away with my vlogs. If you know me you know I get carried away because they always end up being like nearly 40 minutes long now so <laughs> this will be just food just purely because I want it to be a subject based vlog so I can learn how to do that rather than show you everything to do with my life in one day and hopefully it will be about 20 minutes long. We shall see. Last night I made my overnight oats, which I eat for breakfast in the mornings because they're so much nicer. Do you think they're nicer than normal oats? Yes! <laughs> they're so much nicer than hot oats, I personally think. And I recently discovered them and I love them. So I did film me making them last night for this vlog because I always eat them in my vlogs and I don't ever explain how I do them. So I'm gonna pop in that little footage now so you can see how I do it. Doesn't look yum, but it's yum. Twinning! Let's get it in there, get it in there. Good night, overnight oats. I will see you soon. Him and her. His and hers. Yes, and <laughs> Nice try. And now we shall take it from the cupboard of well, the fridge of the his and the hers. Hers is leaving the his. So, as you saw, oh, there's my coffee as well. Little snowman coffee We're on the Christmas mugs. It's just basically like a peanut buttery chocolate overnight oats. And that, because it is rather big, if you look at it next to my head, my head's quite a big size. It is two portions, so I'll have half of it today and half of it tomorrow morning. And it tastes like dessert for breakfast. And it's ready when I wake up, and it only takes about two minutes to prepare the night before, so the best. Breakfast you will ever know is this one. Look at it. It's got almonds on top. It is the nicest breakfast day in the world. Bluebell. Hello. Hey. Oh, there's a cutie. And you are. Hello, Poppy. I'm going to eat this. The thing is, when I made this, well, whenever I make it, I don't measure what I put in, I just literally just guess. But I'm going to hopefully be able to explain roughly how much I put in by scoops and stuff. So, I'm going to eat this now. I need to reawaken my life because right now you could probably tell by my this clip I'm very tired. So, I knew I couldn't eat and drink my coffee before I filmed today because it's a way in a day. And normally I do that so that I'm more awake, if you know what I mean. So, <laughs> I'm having a fight on the sofa. Um, oh, Poppy is so nasty. Don't worry, she never gets her claws out on Bluebell. That's how I know she's not actually being mean. She's just playing a game, you know. I need to reawaken life and eat and drink this. And then I shall be back whenever I eat for more talking about food and eating lots of food. And I don't know, we'll have to see what how the day goes, what the day brings. My little editing partner in crime. We're just currently finishing the edit of my Sunday vlog, which you will already have seen by now. Well, you should have, but it'll be up by the time this vlog's up. So we're just finishing off that edit. I'm halfway through my oats. I'm feeling a bit more alive. And for some reason, one of those channels that sells loads of hoovers is on, and it's just been selling hoovers for the past 20 minutes while I've been editing, which is, a great editing accompaniment to my editing time. In case you don't know me, I don't count macros or calories and I never have. And that is purely because I don't think 
I want to be that strict in my life. I feel like it like destroys food personally for me. I am aware, but I'm just not measuring. And I feel like that's like a really good way of just chilling out and being into fitness and eating nice food. But I have not eaten well the past few days. If you watch my vlog before this, it's not been that bad, but it's just been like eating out quite a lot, which I feel like I don't, it's all right sometimes. Personally, I just prefer to eat at home. I prefer to make my own food because I feel like a lot of food I eat out makes me feel really heavy and I don't know whether that's like the oils they use in it and I also like just knowing what's in my food if you know what I mean but sometimes it's okay especially if it's a Nando's then I can deal with it just a little outline on my story of food is there for you now and I'm gonna finish my edit and just get on with my life and I'll see you when I eat some more food I am ready for the gym now I've just transformed from a teddy bear to a gym girl, a gym shark gym girl. This actually is one of the new gym shark things tops, but I don't have all the other new stuff, so this is why a gym shark haul didn't happen. But this is lovely, and I was gonna go for the full on ninja outfit, you know, the black, black, and then the black one of these, but I thought I'd do a little bit of a spicy Sunday pink look so me and mum are now gonna go to the gym my mum is still visiting from graduation because it's only the day after the graduation vlog ended so she's still here and we're gonna go to the gym and i'm going to do one of my sweaty smith machine workouts that's quick because we want to go out into the sun it's very steamy in here <laughs> i don't know why it's a bit weird I just drew on the window, but we want to get out in the sun before it gets dark and go for a walk with Bluebell. So I'm going to do a really quick workout and Mum's just going to go on the treadmill, I think. So I don't want to be too long because you can't go on the treadmill that long. It's just really boring. So I'm going to go and do, I think the one of the ones I did in my vlogs not that long ago, but I'm not going to take the camera today just because I want to be quick and I want this to be just a foodie vlog. Not too long, you know, so I'll just pop up what I do after this clip. And if I do do the workout from my other vlog, I'll link the vlog below. But we shall see whatever I get up to, you know. But I'm going to go and I also really need a monster to monster up my life because I need a bit of energy. So I'm going to have one of my monsters. Let me see, actually. I think I have some. Let's go and get one. Here's mum ready for the gym, eating in her pajamas. <laughs> Come on, mother. I'm gonna have one of these to boost up my leg session. I don't have them every for every workout, but it's a form of pre-workout that it's like a little more, little bit more toned down than an actual pre-workout because pre-workout I think is much stronger than this and I think I might have a heart attack if I pre-workout so I'm just gonna have one of these zero calorie mono mono monogy monster energy ultra best thing ever if you haven't tried one you should but I'm gonna go and I'm gonna train legs and it's gonna be a sweaty Sunday sesh and we're gonna go for a walkie after oh she is the sleepiest puppy today sleepy Sundays Sunday fun day Sleepy Sunday session. Let's go and say bye to Poppy as well. She's snuggled up on my new throw. Oh, who's a cozy cat? Poppy is. Cozy cat. See you later. Okay. I'm back from the gym and I'm dying. <laughs> that rhymed. So I think what I'm gonna do is make some lunch because I'm starving and my heart is hurting with monster and no food. So that's my mum, one second. So what I'm gonna make me and mum is a bit of an eggy lunch. Purely because, I know it always looks like I eat eggs, if you watch my vlogs I eat eggs a lot for lunch but the reason being is because they're so quick and I'm a bit lazy in the middle of the day to make a big old slap up meal you know. So what I do usually, not all the time but a lot of the time, is I make scrambled eggs. Oh I'm out of breath. That was a sweaty sesh. So what I'm going to do is make some onion and chive basil. We're gonna have one each. I found these and they're not the easiest flavour to find but I found them. <laughs> <laughs> and 
and I'm going to make scrambled eggs with a bit of this bacon in it too. So I'm going to make a big like butty, but a bit of a healthier kind of butty. So a bagel, scrambled eggs, a bit of corn bacon and then some hex sausages cut up like sliced so they'll fit in the butty if you know what I mean. So I'm going to do that and oh and also some spinach to give some greens you know. So I'm going to do this quickly because I'm really hungry. Jesus Christ. I'm just mid cooking and there's something I need to show you, which is food related, but dog food related. <laughs> Basically, I'm gonna feel, feel, I'm gonna feed Bluebell her second meal of the day. Bluebell also has a common with me that she eats three meals a day. So, I'm gonna show you how obedient my 13 week old puppy is. She is. Clever. Right, we're gonna film you doing your trick. You need to do it, okay? You gonna do it for me? Come on. Ready? Okay, now sit. Sit. Now wait. 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 Come in. Good girl, you did it! Yay, clever puppy! How clever is my 13 week old puppy? Very clever. Teach them while they're young, then they will be clever dogs. Anyway, let me carry on with my time lapse. Yum! Healthy buddy for lunchy. <laughs> Me and Bluey B are dying. <laughs> She's cuddled up in my teddy bear coat. But we've just been for our little walk. She's still a snowman, you can't see, but she's got a snowman outfit on. And it's got a little hat. She put it up so everyone can see you. Oh, you look cute today. Yes, we just went for a walk with my mum, and now my mum's gone back to Wales, and me and Bluebell are very tired and a bit confused you know that time of the day at the moment i don't know if it's everywhere but in the uk it gets really dark really early now at like, like four o'clock like it's pitch black yay love it love it <laughs> this has nothing to do with food by the way but i'm just having a little chat because i feel like it i get really cold confused and sleepy on the transition time when it's light and then it's like nope it's dark now and I'm like okay who am I what am I doing and I just lie down and I'm cold but I am going to have a cup of tea and some bourbons and it's gonna be a wonderful snack not the greatest but nice and warm I'm going to make the house all um, cozy I think so I'm gonna put the heating on Do you know what I might try out the electric fire we've got an electric fire it looks like a real one but it's not so here it is let's put it on I'm gonna have a go let me put it on to see what it's like <gasps> how cool it looks real but it's not I love it. I'm going to put some candles on and turn all the main lights off and put the little lamps and fairy lights on and drink my tea, eat my bourbons and I'm going to reply to some of my DMs about the Gymshark sale that's going up tomorrow that will already be happening when this video is up so make sure you go to Gymshark because they're having up to 50% off for a week which is amazing because they've never done that before, I don't think. I'm gonna do that, I'm gonna get cozy. <laughs> wow, I feel like a cozy woman right now. Look at that. What a great thing. And I've got my bourbons here. Where have they gone? Got some bourbons, yeah. There's a snowman on my sofa. <gasps> it's a snowman! Merry Christmas. Merry, Merry Christmas. Do you know what? <laughs> it's a good job that this vlog is not an everything vlog, that it's just a food vlog because I have been sat there 
with blue Berlin as the bird outfit, with my Bourbons and a very now cold cup of tea, answering DMs for how many hours? Two and a half hours! Yep. It's been one of those afternoons where I got wrapped up in something and the hours went by and now my cheeks are right really flushed. You can probably see they're a bit red. And I'm literally still in my coat from my walk and my gym outfit from this morning. I'm a great human that does not know how to do life very well right now. But because it is now nearly eight o'clock, it's time for dinner and it's very late and it's stupid. How did this happen? Days just leave me without my consent and I don't like it very much, but it's fine. Now I'm going to stop working. I'm going to stop working because I'm a celebrity. Get me out of here starts at nine o'clock. Um, I'm going to sit in front of my fire and watch it after I've made my dinner. So I'm going to make this and hopefully it'll be ready so I can eat it while I'm a celebrity on because that would be the best thing ever. So I'm going to make some salmon. Just going to bake it in the oven with some broccoli, steam wrapped, and I'm gonna make my own homemade wedges. So they're not gonna be like chips, they're wedges. And wedges don't sound unhealthy, which means it's a good day and I don't have many potatoes. What's wrong with the day? But it's fine. I'm gonna make the wedges with you and then I'll see you on the other side of the meal because it won't be very fun for you to watch me steam broccoli. <laughs> It would be that fun. We just appreciate my hedgehog cutting board. <laughs> Love it. So, I also forgot to say, I microwaved the potatoes before I put them in the oven to shorten the cooking time, otherwise they take quite a long time. And they only take 20 minutes in the oven when they've been in the microwave for like five to eight minutes. That is the dinner. I think that's gonna conclude this little vlog. And I have kept it little and short, I think. For the first time in a very long time, I don't think this is going to be a long vlog. Don't worry, the long vlogs aren't going anywhere, but I do think it suits what I eat in a day for to be a little bit shorter, you know. I think I've eaten quite well. I haven't eaten quite as much as I should have, but to be honest, the overnight oats are a very good breakfast because they keep me for, for full. <laughs> they keep fulfill the food. They f keep me f <laughs> This is how tired I am. They keep me full for longer than any other breakfast I have had before did, if you know what I mean. They're just a good, it's the best breakfast ever, basically. I'm not gonna lie, I already have lined up in my brain Cocoa Pops for after this meal. And because I just realized that we'd run out of milk, I found a little milk in the fridge and it is currently defrosting <laughs> next to the fire. So I'm hoping this will defrost quickly because I want Cocoa Pops after this. And no doubt I will probably have some Bourbons and some tea. In case you don't know, Bourbons are like chocolate biscuits. So yes, that is what's gonna happen. And I hope you enjoyed this little vlog of food and maybe you found something that you might wanna eat. And don't forget to ask if you need to ask anything about any of the food, because I probably haven't explained everything right anyway. I'm a bit of a slow one on that, but there we go. Thank you so much for watching if you watched, and I hope you enjoyed, and hopefully we'll see you soon in another video. Yeah? T-Rex on the loose. <laughs>